Well, hello, Aquarius. This is your general energy reading for December 17th through the 31st, 2018. You guys know general energy will not resonate with everyone. I try and read these just from one point of view, but that doesn't mean it's not happening in the other point of view. So you could be implementing this or this could be happening to you. But again, general energy isn't going to resonate with everyone. So the best way to get information is to schedule your own private reading. All right, Aquarius. <clears throat> Excuse me. In the highest vibration of love and light, please give me positive insight for Aquarius. What energy is around them? What they need to know about the energy? What they can do about the energy for December 17th through the 31st? And guys, we will have relationship information as well on this video. Aquarius, 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 Aquarius. Venus, Aquarius. Venus, Aquarius. Aquarius. Okay. I'm going to sing in kind of mood today. Aquarius, Aquarius. December 17th through the 31st. That one there. Nourish your soul. It says nourish the soul, but this really feels like you need to be taking care of you. Doing things that feel right for you, feel good for you. Nourishing yourself here. Adjust that just a little. There we go. So really taking care of yourself. That's what you should be focusing on for this last couple weeks of December. And happy holidays, by the way. So Aquarius really just needs to take care of themselves. Do things that nourish their soul. Watch those pennies. Uh-oh, here comes trouble. Smudgy smudger sounds. Aquarius. Sun, moon, and rising. December 17th through 31st. Holding your own, holding your own. You're ready to take on the world. But you need to stop and take care of yourself. I know you're ready to take on the world. I know you're ready to battle. I know you're ready to hold your own because it does feel like you're holding your own. But to continue to be able to do so, to continue to be able to you know, keep your shit together and keep everything the way you want to, you know, it's like you're tapping into your strength. You're tapping into your courage and you're taking from your reserves. You need to replenish your reserves. Okay. All right. So if you don't replenish your, your reserves, if you don't take care of yourself here, if you're not stopping and appreciating life, if you're not stopping and smelling the roses, here comes the train, here comes the train. You know, it's like you just, you got to stop and you just got to, you just kind of got to say, you know what? What I'm doing isn't working. It's time for me to revamp my approach. Maybe I need to start smelling the roses on the other side. Oh my God, you crazy cat. Hold on.
Thank you. I don't, I don't like editing in videos. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> so you had to hold for a second. You know, it's like, I'm doing this, I'm doing this, I'm doing this, I'm doing this, but it's time to break that routine. You've been tapping into that, like I said, to that reserve tank. And it's time to get up and, and head a different direction towards your fulfillment, towards where you find nourishing here. So it feels like you're just being reminded to not only stop and smell the roses, but to smell the roses on both sides, to smell the tulips, to smell the daisies. I know daisies don't have a smell, but you know, to enjoy all the things that make you feel better, all the things that are going to help you grow. Okay. Life gets tedious. So switch things up. I'm hearing, no, it didn't work out the way you hoped. No, things are kind of sucking right now. Yes, you're kicking ass, but... Like, I, I can literally, I keep seeing like an extra tank and we have a tank over here that's big and large and it's empty and there's a smaller one over here but at some point you have to stop and start filling up both sides start finding that balance here I'm seeing That need for, for growth and fulfillment can only be done if you're a whole again. You're kicking ass, you're taking names, but you're not whole, you're not completely fulfilled. And you need to re, yeah, just need to take a break here. So perhaps you have had to put a relationship on the side and this could be a love relationship. This could be a family relationship. It could be relationships with your friends, with your coworkers, but it feels like it's a relationship with you. While well, you're taking care of all the stuff, taking care of it all, taking care of it all, making it, what about you? What are you doing for you? All right. Yeah, you're trying to do something to make your business grow. Because you're Aquarius. Y'all have businesses. You like to make them grow. But what about your soul? We know you want to grow. We know you want to succeed. We know you want to do your best and be on top. But what are you doing to make sure you're at like the prime health to do this? If you're ignoring your cold, your cold's going to turn into the flu. So take care of yourself. Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. I want that one. The only thing that is real is love. Shift your focus from the problem back to love. Shift your focus from the problem back to love. Loving yourself, taking care of yourself, honoring yourself, honoring what you need. And right now, give it a face to focus on since it's out of focus. There we go. This is the thing is Aquarius, you're stubborn. MFers, don't even pretend like you're not because <laughs> you are. And it's your determination that appears as stubbornness. And your determination for the success, if you don't take a break from that and get up and focus on taking care of yourself and yourself, your well-being. If you don't focus on nourishing your soul, I 
just, I feel like you don't have the correct balance. You have to have a balance between work and play and, you know, between work and your relationships, between work and yourself. And if you're not finding that balance, you're not completely wholeheartedly fulfilled. So it's really about working on yourself right now, caring for yourself and loving yourself right now. So Aquarius, go with love and light. Take a break. Take care of you. Do the things that feed your soul that aren't about work, that are about taking care of yourself. And thank you so much for sticking to the end. Please be sure to show some love with some thumbs up. Thank you so much for your subscriptions. I truly appreciate you guys.